everyone. Welcome back. My husband is filming right now and he's making us laugh, but we'll just ignore him. Welcome back to our channel. And we are so excited because a new year, new bookshelf. No more small bookshelf anymore. Our pathetic bookshelf is gone. The well, it's not gone. It's just sitting empty. Yes. We've gone for our channel. <laughs> My poor bookshelf. The problem is now we are in a bigger space where our children like to come around. So we're going to have to forgive them if you ever hear noise. But we are so excited. We actually wanted to get this before Christmas. They were out. So we finally got it. And we are so excited to show you. We've been keeping it a secret. What's on our bookshelf? So we were looking at the Billy from Ikea and we liked it. We were looking for a couple days and what we decided is we really liked kind of a, uh, my daughter calls them cubbies. <laughs> They're like the, what are, she keeps putting her stuff in them. I don't know. We just like it. This is from Ikea. This is the Calyx and I have it on my phone. This is the Walnut Effect Light Gray mm -hmm. and we actually ended up getting two. So my Maybe husband. A little my husband got this one and then he went and got this one for us and he just laid it sideways on top just to make it a little taller and more room to grow, which we're excited about. We actually didn't even think we were going to be able to fill this bookshelf, but we did better than we well, thought. Well, yeah, yeah, we still have some spots to fill. No, we but, de definitely do. But we have more Soon he'll be buying have. us another bookshelf, <laughs> which he will love. <laughs> Anyways, how we kind of organized it is... We kind of decided, because when we film, it'll probably be down here, we kind of decided to do our favorite books behind us. And of course, because we are Sarah J. Moss fans, she smacked Sarah J. Middle. Moss kind of got the start of it. We also have, so we have our Throne of Glass series. Which I have not read yet. Yeah, Sarah is a loser. <laughs> um, we have our Akatar series right here. And our little candle. Yeah, we only have two measly candles, and actually we stole this from my daughter. <laughs> this Harry is the Harry Potter one. That's hers. Actually, these Harry Potter books are my daughter's, but we decided we're stealing it for our channel. and Or our bookshelf, excuse me. So then we kind of went to like our Crescent City, of course, so of all our favorite books. We love The Invisible Life of Addie LaRue. So we added that One of our there. top. And then we kind of went into um, From Blood and Ash series by Jennifer L. Armentrout. Caraval series, which is so good. Yeah, and then her um, Once Upon a, Once Broken, Upon a Heart. Broken Heart that kind of goes with it. And we kind of just kept going. Kingdom of the Wicked, Kingdom of the Curse, The Bridge Kingdom. We have Fable. Savage Lands, if you guys have not read yet. Yes. Read really. this. We're in the middle of this right now. Yes, we're going to hit up the last book. Yes. Which my husband has to go to the mailbox and get my book. Anyways, and then we just kind of kept going down with some of our series. Some of them, actually, I was mad. Sarah made me put even the ones I hate up on here. I did not want to. I didn't think they deserved to be on our bookshelf. But she said, no, we have to fill it. So they're on here. Go as we get They'll get booted out eventually. Because yes. I can't but stand some of these. this is a good these. series right here. The um, yeah, Ember okay. and the Ashes series yeah. by Saba Tahir. Um, we are also in the middle of City of Bones. And this is the UK edition books. So these are beautiful. Feather. Feather and Celestial. And you are in the middle of Starlight right now. Yes, I am. So Starlight just came out, what, in January? Was it January? Th this month. I want to say it was like December maybe, but yeah. It's new. Oops, our light fell. It's okay. <laughs> Keep going. Keep rolling. <laughs> it's still shiny. Um, and then we have some old books that we, you know, we love. The Maze Runner, Scorch Trials, Death Cure, The Kill Order. Um, those are some really good books. You guys have we have the Hunger those. Games. Hunger Games, the new Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes. Really, the okay, <laughs> only Serpent and Dove really deserves to be on this. She did not want to put Blood and These are awful. I didn't like them, but <laughs> they go with this one, and she made me, so we have it on there. Then we also decided to go with one of the books or the series that got us started into fantasy a while ago, which is the Twilight series. So it deserves. Which a you shelf. know, if you watch it now. I watched it a year ago and it was like kind of stupid and I like kind of like laugh like oh my god I'm so obsessed with this it wasn't stupid yeah it is a little stupid well the books are better than the, the movies for sure but I wonder if we read it if we would think it's stupid too I'm sure we think it's good oh I don't I know I might reading. I might have advanced I mean, in my reading I, it's not the best you know how like your taste Some buds mature yeah. as you get older well maybe my yeah reading buds well and mature. then yeah is that <laughs> My husband's laughing. I know reading buds isn't a word. I just said that. Whatever. Oh, guys, 
Yeah. Thunderhead, the toll. This she one should be not on here. The shadow between <laughs> us. Hate. She hated it. Um, and then, sorry, I'm getting a little low. We have not filled our bottom, so we do have room to grow here. Um, but we still added here. You can go talk about over there, Sarah. So oh, so um, Sisters of the Stars and Daughter of the Deep. Which, which is, is not okay. Possible. Yeah, it's okay. Yeah. Um, we have Lore, which was terrible. I hated it. Um, Cirque, Pestilence, which I've heard the other ones are really good. Danielle didn't really. I care didn't like for Pestilence. It. This one, supposedly the rest gets it's better. Good, it's a good um, cover. Um, then we have Cardin, Cardin and, and his Prince, nasty tail, which we didn't really care about. And then we just have the third one of a vow so bold and deadly. We have not read this series yet, <laughs> but we only have the third book. We don't have one or two. Not yet. <laughs> and then, of course, you had to add uh, her daughter's Harry Potter because Harry Potter should be on every single shelf. And then I had gotten this for her for Christmas. It's called The Forbidden Forest. So we stole it. Okay. And then also, um, J.K. Rowling came out with the book. My daughter loved it. It's the Ichabod. I don't know what it's about. I haven't read it. It reminded me of like Hansel and Gretel. I don't know. When I kind of read it years ago, I might be, not a year ago, I might be totally wrong. Um, anyways, those are Sarah's. I don't know what those are. <laughs> then um, you can talk about it if you need. I haven't read them yet, but I heard they're good. Mm, I don't know. And then we have our Six of Crows. Hated that too. <laughs> but Sarah said we had to keep it on. Sarah, the Shadow and Bone. Okay, so Shadow and Bone, we haven't read that we watched the series. <laughs> it's really <laughs> good. So I don't know. Then we have our Game of Thrones. Which we only have three books. We so have right Red now. Queen, which I didn't like the first book. And we have them all. <laughs> so we might have to. I don't and know. your favorite of all time, Three oh, Dark Crowns. This one was horrible. <laughs> I Out of all the books, which is your most hatred or hated book? Oh, jeez. Um, what are the books I don't like again? <laughs> <laughs> you ate them off. I have to. That was my husband snorting. Oh, together. one series. If you guys have not read, I actually oh, yeah. am going back. Fury Born. We read this King's before we started Stain our channel. And Lightbringer. Lightbringer. These are just very good um uh, series as well. And I think we read this right before we started yes. the channel. So we never did And then those. another one that we have that our cousin has at the moment yes. is the Bargainer series. Which By Laura the last time. I loved. Um, she does pestilence that I yes. didn't love. But the Bargainer series is really good so we need to get that. And then obviously we have our classics here. Well, we have how many classics? Well, we had Redeeming Love, which we saw the movie yesterday. Yes. Which is amazing. Everyone should go first read it and then go see the movie. And we have our Gone with the Way Little Woman. Yes. These are some of our little ones. Like, we're, um, this one was really good. Where Before We Were Yours was a really good one. And Where the Crawdad Sink. This is going to be a movie. Reese Witherspoon, I believe, is directing it. So good. Then we have, oh, gosh. We gotta, these are my favorite Huff and Puffs. I couldn't get rid of them. <laughs> I just, the Wicked Duke. Come on, ladies. Look at these men. <laughs> Anyways, I love these Huff and Puffs. I had to put them on my shelf. Other ones I get rid of, but not those ones. Those ones will stay with me forever. And then um, I found this book. I don't really know what it's about. Looks good. I'll read that soon. And then these are kind of just like filler books. <laughs> well, these are my husband's oh. books. Uh, Lone Survivor, which is a good movie. So I'm sure it's a fantastic book. Unbroken. Didn't even see the movie. I'm sure it's good. <laughs> American Sniper, saw that movie, yeah. good. Oh, and The Chef, actually this should be with like down here probably. This is a great, well I didn't read this either. My husband actually <laughs> did, but the movie is good. I loved it. So The Shack, and then these are actually, we have read these, you said you didn't Yes, know. well these I are like change. suspense. But The Life Between Us I really enjoyed. <laughs> I didn't like it this actually. Is really good. It was okay. Um, what, what happened to the one that was really good that we, it was suspenseful, but these oh. are a little more of our suspenseful ones. She heard this was good and wanted to read it. She never did. Mm -hmm. And then um, over here, I don't know why this is up here. It should be down here. But <laughs> um, say. my cousin just got me, because I'm a big Bravo Housewives fan, not all diamonds and rosé, um, about, I think it's all the women that sit and talk. So that one just is living up here for now until I can get to it. And then we just decided, I thought this was really funny because we overthink everything. We say that a lot. Like, mm -hmm. well, we think we're dumb. We'd say you guys give us everything yeah. to talk about. So if we overthink it all. Mm -hmm. And then, so I thought that was really cute. I got that at Target, actually. 
And then we got our little um, quote. What are Wait. they called? Quote I don't words? know. Maybe. It's I don't know. I don't know what this is. It's a word board. Word. Yeah. Which that thing. Word board. And then we got an S and a D little candle because it's Sarah. It's, yeah. oh, it really should be other way, but I don't know. Danny and Sarah's booked out reviews. So anyways, this is our bookshelf. The more we and, get, the more it'll fill and the more some books we'll And leave. it'll probably all change, yeah. but that's okay. We will get rid of the bad books. That'll be fun. Yes. Yes. That's what I mean. And then we'll put them on your shelf or something. <laughs> <laughs> anyway. I don't know. I don't know how. How do you guys like our bookshelf? We were really excited about it. Oh, and and it's new to us. My husband put little lights behind. We were actually thinking of like getting like little lights here, so we can see it more. But it's kind of like the background of the light. It looked really pretty at night. Yeah, maybe one day we'll have to like show them at night. And so anyway, so he put lights behind it for us. I don't know. Sarah still wants to maybe get like the fairy, fairy lights. lights and do some more. So. It's a start anyway, but we're excited. So this is our new filming spot. We're gonna have to kick our kids out all the time and tell them to be quiet. Tell my husband, my husband, okay, we were starting to film this mm -hmm. and he was upstairs talking and you could hear every word he said. <laughs> so I said, oh, this is not gonna be easy. He has always. a deep voice, so you can- Yes, he's, he's very loud. He's a loud thin walls. Yeah, he doesn't know how to be quiet. <laughs> Anyways, guys. Thank you for coming along with us to look at our new bookshelf, which we're super new excited. Spot. And I hope you like it. It's better than our rink -a -deek pathetic one. That got us through many videos. It did. And you guys have been asking what's on our bookshelf. We've had a few people ask. So this is what's on our bookshelf. I think we got most everything down here. I wanted to not have some of them down here, but we she made me. But that's okay. <laughs> I'll forgive her. Anyways, guys, we would love for you to subscribe and like our channel. It helps us out, and we appreciate everything you guys have done for us, and we're having a lot of fun. And that's it. We'll see you soon. So I know all of you guys have been asking about our if we have a Instagram, a Instagram. channel, and we just started one. Um, it is called Every Night I'm Dancing. <laughs> I kind of just came up with the name. Yeah, I like it. It's cute. Um, yeah, and you. But it also says Danny and Sarah. Yes, I mean, you'll see so our. So you'll know it says. Um, so I plugged our YouTube channel on there in the bio as well. So I'll also put it in the description below on this video um, that you can go on and come and follow us. And I believe, do we have to say this? I don't know. Um, it's like every underscore night underscore. Yeah, it'll come um, up. You guys like will that. see it. I don't think there's very many every night. I'm and dancing. if you see daddy and Sarah. Obviously. Yeah. That's so us. yeah. So come along support and support us. us. We need your support. It's just brand spanking new. It's just a tiny little baby. We got it. To, <laughs> it has to grow. <laughs> and, okay. and we already have our first typo on a redeeming love. I spelled it wrong. R -E -D -E -M. She did that one. -E -M. I know, <laughs> stupid, but it was already up to it. We, we, we called it out. We said, gah, or whatever. Yeah. We, we whatever we said. It. But that's us. So, yeah, we're done. It's okay. <laughs> so come and follow us. <laughs>